Basically, we've been established for about 50 years, so we've uh, manufactured specialist spray application technologies. And <clears throat> basically, we most of our business is probably in agriculture, uh, but we also have specialist markets in the industrial sector and also for animal health, where we're working with uh, Merial on vaccine delivery. With, uh, with a, st a standard sort of pump-up sprayer um, type of thing you'd use in your garden, um, the, the, those are using pressure-based uh, nozzle, hydro hydraulic energy nozzle, and that basically is creating a range of droplets. So you've got large droplets and small droplets. And what we want for a respiratory vaccine for a chicken is we want uniform droplets so that the droplets are not too tiny to go too far down into the respiratory system. And we don't want them too big either, that they'll fall on the floor and not be taken up by the chickens at all. So when Mariel developed the Ulvavac spray with Micron, the aim of it was to develop a sprayer specifically for chickens, specifically for giving respiratory vaccines. We, we, we began almost 20 years ago actually with uh, Mariel. Uh, we were approached by one of their the veterinary scientists and uh, who was interested basically in, in getting better vaccine delivery. And, um, we, we had done a little bit of work previously in the, the poultry industry, but really it was the connection there, getting a direct relationship established with the, the, the vaccine manufacturer, where we could actually get, um, we could e better understand exactly what the, the market needed for um, what we're doing. And, and really the development that came out, out, of, out of that collaboration, um, we basically took the same technology, we had the rotary atomizer technology, uh, which was creating the spray particles that we needed for the vaccine delivery. Um, we had uh, came up with a very compact, small uh, unit which could be carried by uh, one hand, effectively. A small battery pack, a uh, 12-volt battery pack, which could be carried over the shoulder. And uh, the idea really was to have something where the, uh, the farmers, the growers, could go into, um, for this was targeting broilers, uh, where they could go into the sheds and they could treat, deliver the vaccine in about 20 minutes. We, we have a, a one litre uh, graduated bottle here for the preparation of the vaccine. Uh, the vaccine we can fill, uh, we add the water here and then we add the vaccine uh, in the vial uh, and then it's, it's mixed in there and it's secured. And then all we're using is when we turn the sprayer over, we're using gravity to feed the liquid. This is the spinning disc, which is creating the, 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 the droplets. Um, the liquid is fed through a colour-coded nozzle uh, here, which can, uh, this can be uh, exchanged. Um, the disc itself, which is the, the key part of the technology, uh, you can see internally here that you have uh, some grooves and teeth uh, on here, which is for the formation of the of the droplets. So the speed of the disc uh, when it's spinning, uh, the centrifugal forces create the droplets and the faster we spin it, the smaller the droplet. So we've got a, a small fan uh, driven by electric motor uh, also here and the fan there is just to propel the spray away from the, uh, from the unit over a distance of three metres.